But I did actually just go get some makeup with my money. So today I'm going to be recording a drugstore makeup haul. I spent $43, I believe. I don't know why I put it two up. I spent $43. Um, I just went to CVS. It was only one place, but like, you know. I'm going to show you guys anyways because I really liked some of the stuff I got. Um, so first I got this Beauty 360 Bamboo Powder Brush. Like, I think this was $8. Um. It's supposed to be some natural kind of brush, but I really needed a powder brush, so I got this. I thought it was really adorable. Mm. And also, um, this was, this was going to be like 57 or something like that, but I did have some coupons, and I used sales and stuff like that. I got this e.l.f. small stipple brush just to apply some foundation on. I was supposed to like make your foundation look a little bit more natural and stuff like that, so I'm going to give this a try. Um, and then I got... Um, this NYX natural eyeshadow kind of palette, tiny little palette type of thing. So yeah, I'm really excited to use this because you guys know I am absolutely obsessed with natural eyeshadow looks and really wanted a new palette because I'm getting kind of iffy with my old ones and I'm using them a lot. So yeah, and this was really cute and I think it was about $8. Oh yeah, and this e.l.f. brush was $3. I got this e.l.f. shadow lock eyelid primer. Um, e.l.f. is like one of my favorite products for like cheaper, ooh, I don't know why this, for like cheaper makeup. Um, but I really wanted to try this. Um, I do usually use e.l.f. eyelid primer. Just because it's like a dollar. And I don't want to spend like seven dollars on eyelid primer. But um, it's new. It's actually a new thing they just came out with. So I was like, okay, I'm going to try it. Since I did try all their other primers. And I needed a new primer. So here's that. I believe that was, this was like two dollars or something like that. It's like not even expensive, like so if I try something new with e.l.f. I'm like, okay, well this isn't good, this is good. It doesn't really matter, I'm not really spending that much on it. And then I also got my e.l.f. Um, brightening eye pencil, it comes with the little sharpener. I have like three of these because I always buy this pack. Um, but yeah, I really like this um, eyeliner pencil. Just basically an eyeliner pencil, it's like a dollar, so <laughs> yeah. This is CoverGirl Jumbo Gloss Balm Cream. And this is, I actually got a pink shade. You guys know I hardly ever wear pink shades. But I thought this shade was actually really pretty and it's in 290 Berries and Cream. Just this really kind of like dark kind of pink. I don't know. I feel it's like not too light, not too dark. Actually would probably go good with me. Um, I don't know. I'm just, oh yeah, this was $8 but I got it for $4 because I had this deal. Um, and then I got the Maybelline Fit Me. Powder, I don't, this kind of fit, yeah, this really fits my skin tone, I think. Um, right now my skin looks really red, it's just because of the lighting, it's so annoying. Um, but this is in 355 Coconut, I guess. Um, there was two shades I was kind of going in between, like should I get the darker one, should I get the lighter one? Because my skin color is like in between, so I just got the darker one. Um, I'll try it out, see if it works out. My mom said just get this one, it looked better, but I don't know, but we'll try it. Because I, as you guys know, I don't use, um powder. I just use this translucent powder I have. So I really wanted to try a powder and this was about $8 I think which yeah hopefully it's good. Said it blends seamlessly. Okay. <laughs> and then I got this baby lips. Uh, yeah I took it out of the package because I just used it because oh my gosh I really wanted to use it so much bad. Like so much bad. So bad. Um, It's like moisturizing. This is in the package is probably in here. This is a 15 cherry me. I don't know it was like $5. You know, I really wanted this. My friend has it. And I was like, oh my gosh, I need to get it. So, that's that. Um, and then I got, last, this is last thing. Yeah, last thing I got was this CoverGirl Bombshell Intensity Eyeliner. Which this was like, I want to say $9. I usually just buy $2 eyeliner. But I really wanted to try like a new eyeliner. Because the e.l.f. eyeliner that I get like rubs off. And it doesn't stay all day and stuff like that. So, Baja Blast, Taco Bell, life. Okay, but... So I really wanted to try a new eyeliner. Um, since I have money, like when I have money, I feel like I try a lot of new things. So I actually have money to buy them and like buy more expensive products. Not really expensive, but like higher quality, I guess. Um, so this is 24 hour long wear. So I was like, okay, I'll try it. And this is in pitch black 860. Because not the only one who can't wear brown eyeliner or like light black, I like to wear like dark, dark, <laughs> dark stuff. But yeah, um, it just looks like this. I don't know. If you guys have ever bought any of these new products that I bought, like the eyeliner and like the lip stuff and the powder, then tell me what you guys think about it. 
Um, and just tell me, like, thumbs up this video if you guys like these kind of, like, kind of, like, short, kind of, like, kind of, like, no. If you guys like these, like, small kind of, like, makeup hauls or whatever, because I think I'm going to be buying a lot more makeup and I'm just trying new things. Um, I, I hardly ever buy makeup from Sephora. From Sephora, like I really do want to get a uh, naked palette. No, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. And again, if you like have any opinions on any of these products I got, um, comment below. Comment below your favorite drugstore makeup products, and I will see you guys next week. And love you guys. Bye.